Hey there, Virgo. I know you asked me for a reading yesterday and the cards didn't get to it, but I might be done because, uh, I don't know, I just had a 10 minute video just disappear after it was done. It was all recorded and just like gone. So needless to say, I'm not very excited about that. So I'm going to do your reading because you asked for it. Uh, I do do personal readings and that's why I come on here and do the free ones. Just saying. Anyhow. Um, it's never too late to be what you might have been. George Elliott. I also have an office in Hanover, Massachusetts, um, that can get in-person readings. So let's have a see what's going on. Virgo. I'm sitting on the dog's foot. It's never too late to be what you might have been. All right. Chaos, disarray, the value of chaos before order. It's, that's how you learn your lessons. Uh, making a plan, a strategy, let there be peace on earth. So that's about radical acceptance. I'll take that card. And communication, signs and symbols. Uh, oh, let's stay at the bottom. So something about a female energy or about a mother. Or, I don't know. We'll find out here. Shh, we don't have a lot of time for you just to be talking out of turn, y'all. Uh, so, anywho. Tarot with D. Oh, 40. Tarot with D, 43. I'm also on YouTube. Chaos and conflict with the past lovers here, with the Six of Cups, with the memories and the nostalgia. Somebody could be fighting with themselves here about what to do and how to do it. Like, what, what, what are these children even doing? What are they thinking here? Can I have another one? Like, are they ever going to be able to get it? Nine of Swords, Queen of Cups. I feel like somebody is very, like, a nurturing person. I, somebody is worried here very much about the soulmates and the past stuff and how the people are going to move on from being torn down. Eight of Swords. So there's Purgatory right there. That's the Eight of Swords twice. The Eight and the Nine is the Eight of Swords. So, you know, it's something to do possibly again with children because there's a child laying next to her. Um... Somebody is refusing to take responsibility for their own actions or somebody is looking at some shits out in the world and just not understanding it. And that's Nine of Swords stressing the people right the fuck up out. Uh, the Nine of Swords. So I do feel like the communication here, the messages, the messaging, Eight of Wands about where things are going is like there's miscommunication. Ten of Swords. Somebody is... Um, Stuck in a, a shitty ass uh, cycle. Ten of swords, ten of swords, ten of swords. People just walk all over. I don't even know. Uh, walk all over people. Uh, the tower is the chaos that's right before there. So what's next here? Uh, painful ending. So let the shits go. Or don't, you know. So something about roses. I keep seeing them all day. My friend gave me a few of them this morning. So, you know, I don't know. Uh, maybe somebody would like some sort of flowers and the ever unfolding rose. It's happening for you, not to you. Came out uh, in one of these cards, one of these things, and that 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 is one of my favorite things. It's like we're nobody's victim. You just gotta carry on. My hair is a mess. I gotta fix that in case I maybe if I if I shh. if you knew that you would be supported, what would you do here? So the empress, something may have to do with a mother. Again, the feminine, the yin energy was out there. It's out here. What is love? Um, that, that just went right into a song for me. But it is a question, a strategy. Like, what are we doing? Where do we go from here? Um, I, I don't even know how to get through to you anymore. I don't know how you even... I, 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 I don't know. This is very confusing to someone. Like... How do you think that plan's gonna work? Like, can you recite, repeat that to me? Cause that sounds a little wonky, a little wacky. Something, someone is breaking someone's heart, a grandmother's heart, a mother's heart, or some woman is sick and in pain here, uh, a matriarch. Also the Empress is about receiving. So I do feel like, you know, Part of this strategy is is putting the things together. It's not acting it out. Like you can only lead the people so much, right? The words you just you can tell them if they don't get it, they don't get it. Page of cups, a lot of pages for a small reading. Two of cups, definitely worried about the soulmate strength and about what their path is up ahead of them. Uh, it's almost like you feel like rattling the people too. Like how do you not get it? And you know this is passing down 
from generation to generation, all of a sudden there's all these question marks anyway. Like, how did we get here? A message in a bottle. What's all these signs and communication here? Maybe somebody is having trouble communicating. Well, I'm going to tell you, the universe is trying to communicate with you. Uh, King of Wands about some sort of action that needs to be taken. The hangman, the perspective of the things. Like, staying in this place here and not, not forward movement. Because I feel like somebody's afraid they're going to be persecuted here. They're going to they're gonna pay for it. But the universe is like, listen, if you don't hurry the fuck up and pick a road, because that's that's two wands. The king of wands and the ace of wands is the two of wands. Is decide to... So these messages, the signs and symbols are coming in from all over the place. This is also psych This is psychic energy. Both very psychic energy. You may be consulting someone or something like that you may have some sort of mentor or maybe you are the mentor about where to next uh somebody is putting in a lot of effort and hard work and and a lot of time into i was going to say perseverance and there's the seven of wands and there's the eight of pentacles so i feel like um Somebody is getting signs and symbols that they have mastered something with the magician. Because the hermit is about mastering the soul. The magician is about a mastery of communication or manifestations, opportunities, and bringing them towards you. The seven of wands is just that. This person's fighting off all these people. And they're like, I can and I will, and you can and you will, and you should sit right there. Right? And so maybe you're telling the people, like, listen... I'm not, I can't do the things for you, okay, judgment. It's up to you to do the things, the devil. And if you want to go ahead and play with the devil, expect to pay the devil. The And there's the hierophant. So this is definitely soulmate contracts that you have. And that's why you're talking about the things for wants. Because they have to do with your home, your family, your work, all that shit. See, you want to get down? Or you just want to get in my lap? But we're not doing that. So there's a lot of magic out here. Uh, spiritual matters. Somebody is trying to dig down deep to have the patience to, to wait for the people to wake up and heal the shit. Somebody could be a healer. Somebody needs a healer. Uh, somebody is trying to, like, um, get a point across, but, like, nicely. And I feel like you can't, you can't be all nicey-nicey. Someone's afraid of hurting someone's feelings. Uh, don't trust everything you see. Even salt looks like sugar because the devil is right there, y'all. Life goes on whether you choose to move on, take a chance in the unknown, or stay behind, locked in the past, thinking about what could have been. You were born an original. Don't be a copy. Stop lining up with all the people. You don't have to get in line. You don't have to. You don't have to. Just do you, be you. Boundaries. Where do you feel you need to establish boundaries better? And, yeah. Yes. Somebody's always trying to take something from you. You offer the things and that's not really what they want. They want it in a different way. And it's like, I, I need your help. Well, you should do X, Y, and Z. No, I don't want to do that. No. But I need your help. Why aren't you helping me? It's like, no. I, I, this is how I would do it and you're not going to do that. So fuck you. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not gonna. So I'm just, hands off. No, thank you. Um, golden Christed, 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 Golden Christed Dragon. Absorb the Christ light. You are protected. Expand your heart and remain fifth dimensional. So I feel like somebody's trying to pull you back down to like the 3D world. And you're like, I'll be fucking damned if I go back there. I am not. I cannot. And I will not. There's a rival right here. Yeah, there's nothing back there for me. And nothing but problems. This sounds a lot. There's a lot of time traveling energy out today. I don't know exactly what people are doing. But could have to do with dreams, astro traveling, uh, lucid dreaming actively participating in uh in, in your awakening and in your future here with spirit queen of cups death so a scorpio could have something to do with something right uh again with the psychic energy that we already kind of i think i already talked about it right uh and listen to your intuition the queen of cups also is very feminine energy uh somebody i i feel like is hmm uh, can i have another card very detached. And the only way to, 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 to not feel that is to pull the anchor up and move on because there's a bunch of burdens here with the albatross and the high priestess with the secrets and the soulmates and stuff. There's only so much you can do. 
All right, divine intervention. Your spirit guides are trying to communicate with you about some sort of contract. There could be emails and shits running around with this, but duality, and it's all about timing, and the time is now as above, so below.